Hey folks, everything new under the sun. This is a 12240 split phase uh, EG43 kilowatt, kilowatt inverter configuration. And uh, as part of the configuration, I had a problem where it was showing uh, a warning code of 19. 19 was flashing on the units. I couldn't figure out what it was. And uh, this video serves as an explanation of how to actually solve that. And I, I show you and walk you through the, the configuration that you need there. Okay, update. I had a, a flashing 19 here. Uh, these units are in split phase 12240 configuration uh, with the communication cables. Uh, one single cable uh, to communicate with the, the battery and the BMS over here. And uh, with them both on LI4 for battery type, um, they would flash uh, 19. Uh, even after I got everything working, 240 volts working, everything's uh, great. But they wouldn't stop. Um, so. I went on to uh, the Will Prowse forum, and uh, the answer was there. There, so I'll, I'll save it, uh, or I won't save it. I'll, I'll give it to you guys as well if you're watching the video to get rid of it. Basically, you need to set the master. In this case, this is master. You know master because the flashing P right beside the light bulb there, uh, whereas the slave has a steady P beside the light bulb, uh, light bulb there. So on the master, you leave it as Li uh, four. Let me go to the config here. So uh, uh, setting number five is Li4, that's a lithium iron phosphate. That's the uh, Eagle battery, whatever you got there, uh, life power. Um, but on this unit, uh, you need to set it to, on this unit, you need to set uh, option five to AGN. Uh, select AGN, hit enter, and then hit escape. And basically the master will update this to the LI, the lithium there. Um, and that gets rid of the error code. So set your slave uh, battery number 5 setting uh, to AGN. And uh, then it will uh, synchronize between the two of them. And that error will go away. And uh, all your problems uh, will be solved for uh, error code or, or warning code 19.